these are my thumbs and these thumbs are gonna take me from France to Vietnam and this is the story. Hey guys, good to see you again. Welcome back to another video. So first I want to thank everyone who saw my last video. It's over 2,000 views, which is the most I've had so far. Thank you so much for the support. It really means a lot to me. So today's video is gonna be about creation superstitions. There's a pregnant lady in the car and she told me that there's some really funny superstitions about being pregnant. So I will have a pale baby girl because I went to the funeral pregnant. <laughs> And it's a girl, it's because I have uh, freckles. freckles on my face. <laughs> my name is Matea and I'm from Zada. And uh, in Croatia, we say when uh, you are like a little kid, you can't drink coffee because you're gonna grow a tail. Our parents uh, don't want us to drink coffee. So. Another Croatian superstition. So when the black cat crosses the street, you need to spit three times over your left shoulder or you need to wait for someone to pass to take the curse and then you're okay to go yeah. so I always wondered if a Croatian man and a Croatian woman go on a date and then they both see a black cat do they both spit in the middle of the date over the left shoulder three times? Like, does that actually happen? Because how, <laughs> how unattractive would that be? So there's another thing that I've learned about here in Croatia. It's a superstition, but they take it very seriously, and it's called propuhis, uh, and it's uh, two, two windows. It's open, and then uh, people are scared because the wind comes inside. Yes, yes. So when you have that window open, and, and when you and have that, this window open, this the air in between is called propuh, and the people go crazy yes, about it. Yes. <laughs> okay. Voila. Thank you. I'm really sorry. I I I. I Ivanka. You, Ivanka. Okay. Okay. So this is Ivanka, and this is what's her name? Andrea. Andrea. Ciao. And she told me something, a really interesting creation superstition. <laughs> in Slavonia, where you throw an uh, apple over the house, it's uh, a happiness in your marriage. A good luck for the oh, marriage. good luck for your marriage, yeah. So, Lena was explaining something to me, an interesting creation uh, superstition. Okay. When you have a table that's square, you must sit here. Never here. You cannot sit here. But here and here and here is okay. Because if you sit here, can you just say what happens? Nika se neće šuženit. It means you won't get married. If you sit here. Yes. Yes. Okay. Uh, I sit on this because uh, grandma always taught me don't sit on the uh, cold, ground. cold ground because you get sick your kidneys and your so, n so now you're sitting on the Can cardboard. So. You'll be yeah. pissing painfully. <laughs> You'll be pissing painfully. Okay, so I'm with my boy, boy Sven. Yes. If we're talking and then like something falls, then it's what? It's true. It means whatever I was saying is true. Yes. Okay. Voila, book. So the last couple of days I've been asking some of the Christians that I've met to tell me about any other Christian superstitions. So this is what they told me. I have a really bad headache, bro. Do you have medication? Yeah, yeah, here's some medicine. Here, here, here. Thanks, bro. No, bro, you don't say thank you when I give you medication. It's bad luck. You don't say thank you when someone gives you medication. Bro, what are you doing? Why are you screaming over my feet? It means I'm not going to get married. In Croatia, if someone screams over your feet, it means you won't get married. For this next one, we're going to pretend like I'm a young child. What are you doing, bro? If you step over me while I'm laying down, it means I'm not gonna grow. So in Croatia, if someone steps over someone who's young, when they're laying down, it means they're not gonna grow. Hey, bro, do you know how to use this? I want to shave. Just read the user manual, bro. Bro, I'm not gonna read the user manual. It's not cool if you read the user manual. So this one's not so much a superstition, but in Croatia, if you read the user manual, it's not cool. Remember, do you believe it's already dark outside? Oh, okay. What are you doing? You don't whistle at night, it's bad luck. <laughs> so apparently it's bad luck if you whistle at night in Croatia. Oh bro, my knee hurts. Your knee hurts? Yeah. Oh bro, I have the perfect cure. Here. If you just take some foil and some cabbage, really? put it on your knee and it's a perfect solution. Right. So apparently in Croatia if your knee hurts and you use cabbage and foil with plastic and wrap it around, it's the perfect cure for your knee pain. 
Yeah, bro, did you see there is a half moon outside? There is a half moon outside? Yeah. Oh man, take this money, go outside, and then show the money to the half moon. Because in Croatia, if you show money to the half moon, you're going to have more money. So for the purpose of this one, we're going to pretend that dog Bambi there is a bird, okay? Okay, I have to go. Okay, bro, make sure to take this umbrella. Oh, why? Bro, if there's a bird on the ground, it means it's going to rain. Take the umbrella so you don't get wet. So in Croatia, there's a superstition that if there's a bird on the ground, it's a sign that it's going to rain. Hey, bro, good morning. Time to what? wake up. Oh. Oh. What are you doing, bro? Why would you get up on your left foot? You're going to have a bad day now. Oh, shut up. So apparently in Croatia, if you wake up and put your left foot on the floor first, it means you're going to have a bad day. There is one that I didn't mention. It's called, I think it's pronounced Yugo. It's J-U-G-O. And it's this wind that when it comes from the sea, apparently gives you a headache, which is called Yuzina. If I pronounce it wrong, I'm sorry. But um, it's apparently this wind that comes from the sea that you feel sick after. And last one before I go. This right here is called Rakia. It's a very, very popular Croatian, but generally in the Balkan, liquor. And it is used as a medicine for all kinds of things. If you have a headache, if you're, something is hurting you, I don't know exactly, I'm not from the Balkan, but they use it for many different sicknesses. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, I hope you found it funny. I want to thank all the Croatians who I spoke to the last couple days, who confirmed some of these superstitions for me. So this is my first time making a superstition video, so I would be happy to know what you guys think about it, so please let me know below in the comment section. For the Croatians watching this, if there's any superstitions that I forgot, please let me know below. I'm also curious about your opinion, what was the craziest or funniest superstition for you? So if you like the video, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, there's also a notification bell, so if you hit the bell, there's going to be a notification next time I upload a video. Voila, u budan dan, vidimo se. Do like this, left. But no. you already did that, just I, be I, 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 I like, I'm like that. Already. Yeah, you like that, you like that. Okay. What, what am I doing? I do, I... I'm just talking. Yeah, now. okay. What are you doing, bro? Why would you wait? You gotta, okay, again? Let's say, oh, shut up, louder. Oh, yeah. What are you doing, bro? Why would you get up on your left foot? Now you're gonna have bad luck today. Oh, shut up. <sighs> okay, that was fine. <laughs> okay, you just gotta hold it down. There you go. Thank you. Wait. Thank you.